as we talked about earlier on the show mm-hmm. is 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 you got to become comfortable with yourself and realize that you were there already. How do you know that? If you're God and you're the oldest one and you built the pyramids and you built this and all the wonders of the world are yours, then how the the the, the real problem is real is is you saying that you are devoid of it and there's something that you need to do. The right. only thing you need to do is realize it. So, so most people, from the human perspective, have been taught to in, uh, for improvement. You get what I'm saying? So a lot of people are trying to improve themselves. They're trying to become better speakers, better readers. A lot of people tell me all the time what it is they're not good at. What right. if I said, you need to fall in love with what you're not good at? Right. Motherfuckers will pause for a minute. And it's real. That's the hard part. It's not learning what you think you need to learn. It's right. actually falling in love with what you're not good at. Mm-hmm. If we talked about earlier, good and bad are the same thing. New car and old car are the same thing. Then what you're not good at, guess what? It's actually what you're good at. Right. So, so, and I also talked about you have to find the divinity in everything. Yeah. So what you think is a flaw if you find the divinity in that flaw, you can find the divinity in the flaw in you. And once you find the divinity in the flaw in you, you start to deify yourself. Right. This is about self deification. Right. So, so everything you do, if you wipe your ass with paper towels <laughs> instead of toilet tissue, right? You need to you need to deify that. Listen. Remember the chaos books I talked about? Oh yes. K- uh, uh, Carol, Carol, Peter Carroll and, and Phil Hines. Yes. Mm-hmm. The mantra in those chaos books. Remember I told you all these white people use that as the religion. Yeah. Well, one of the mantra in that in those books are this. Um, and and um, let me treat. Uh, uh, let me let me actually get it right. Uh, what they say is uh, nothing is real. Anything's possible. I think that's it. Oh yeah, nothing um uh any or anything's possible. No, no, nothing is real, anything's possible. So what does that mean? That means what you hold it on to as real, you can turn that into absolute possibility. So if it's real that you don't walk like everybody else, you can right. make it potential or possibility if you so choose. Nothing yeah. is real. Who said you're not walking like everybody else? What if everybody else is walking fucked up? These right. are the things that you. These are the things that you have to probe. These are the things that you have to make real. Do you not? Do you remember when I was saying? Well, Bobby Hemmings is one of the niggas that could just this 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 make fucking lemonade out of anything. You know how <laughs> niggas say we're gonna turn lemons into lemonade? Yes. This motherfucker can turn oranges into lemonade. <laughs> yes, he can. How about that shit? You know what I'm saying? Because because it's not that he's trying to show me that nothing is real and anything is possible. He believes that shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? He right. believes that shit. And that's a testimonial to his power to me. Yeah. At least for me. You get what I'm saying? When I dealt with him, his testimonial was not that he was trying to show me nothing is real and anything is possible. That's that's the line. Nothing is real. Anything is possible. That's the line of the chaos thing.